afternoon. Welcome. You're watching Business Today TV. I'm Sakshi Batra. Well, a festival of IPOs is all set to begin. That's right. A huge IPO rush is what you can expect on D Street. And that's over the next one, one and a half months with over a dozen companies really gearing up to raise about 12,000 odd crore rupees through the primary market. Now, remember, so far in 2022, about 21 companies have already raised over 43,000 crores via these IPOs. Now, if you're someone who is always on the lookout for newer opportunities, buying in the IPO market, then definitely you should keep out uh, an eye for this non-bank finance company, which is a Chennai-based uh, five-star uh, business finance, which actually has got the IPO approval from SEBI earlier in January this year and maybe now launching its IPO, which could be worth about 2,700 crores after Diwali. Apart from this, eminent cardiologist Naresh Trehan promoted Medanta brand of hospitals may also be looking at a street debut with a launch of about 2,200 to 2,500 crores IPO this month alone. Now, from the healthcare space, there could also be an offer for sale from Global Health of about 2,500 crore rupees. Now, the, some of the promoters who may be exiting partially their stake may actually raise uh, money through this listing, whereas giving opportunity to newer participants in the markets to also take a pie of the Global Health company. Now, Delhi-based Pristine Logistics and Infra Projects is also likely to launch an 1,100 crore IPO later in this year. Keynes Technology, Uniparts India, both of these companies are expected to launch 1,000 crore rupees IPOs each in the coming uh, few months as well. Now, some of the other companies uh, which are expected to hit the D Street in 2022 in the last part also could include Keystone Realtors, Landmark Cars, India Exposition Mart, DCX Systems, Inox Screen, and GPT Healthcare. All of these companies are expected to raise funds ranging between 500 crores to 850 crores in the upcoming IPOs. Remember that some of the recent IPOs that have already got some uh, stellar listing on the D Street received very strong response from investors, including Electronic Smart, Harsha Engineering, Team Folk Services, all of these companies had got over 50 times and 70 times kind of subscription in the IPOs that they had launched. That also indicates that there is a huge investor appetite for the new and upcoming companies. So gear up in case you are on the lookout for newer listings coming up in this year during the festive season as well and save up on that cash. But don't forget to speak to your financial advisor before drawing up a list of the companies that should make a part of your portfolio. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.